Take me and I'll crush you! Let's see who crushes who! Walked into an auto. The punchline. Apparently, it's a family business that's fallen. My hunch is the owner's finally. And you know, I got a nose for this stuff.
Finger on the trick, V. madness.
Trevor Sharp and Snazzy, Josh. <laughs> Best believe it. Gotta represent, right? No, but, but for real now. Why are you always so dressed up? Keeps a wife from wondering. Tell her I'm headed to the office every morning. We'll be coming here six months, and she don't suspect a thing. <laughs> Well, well, who do I spy but V? In my humble parlor, no less. Okako, long time no see. So what brings you here? Willing to bet nobody knows Westbrook like you do. My husbands knew Westbrook, yes. Each of them, very high in the tiger claws. Ruled Japan town. What did they do? They did what made the best eddies. Gave them the most pool, sold sex, and black market tech. Can't help asking. How many of those husbands did you have? Five. All went before the time. Terrible family tragedy. Not afraid that tragedy will strike you? Have to live somehow. For my nine sons. Have some outstanding biz to settle. Remember Sandra Dorset? I don't forget such things, V. Here is your reward. It comes with a fairly ample bonus. Go see a Ripper Doc. They'll weave you a dermal imprint that will enable smart gun compatibility. A Tiger Claw specialty. Yo, yo, ever try rainbow poppers? Um, bum, Purple haze? Um, um, Got every color under the sun I do. You want trouble? Listen to that guy. How'd you rate his chops? To my untrained ear, sounds all right, I guess. Easy listening, at least. No why? Technique's second rate. But the feeling? That's what counts. Guys hurt, got something. Can't take, and it shows. Could stand a little more stage presence. Fingering's all wrong, loses the tempo more than he keeps it, but not bad. Really know how to give a guy a compliment. That how you got your start? Street busker with big dreams? Don't make me laugh. No time for playing my way to the top. Was too busy shaking the world awake. Being at the top can be worth it. Wanna shake the world, you know? The world's gotta feel you first. And you pay for it. You spend your lyrics laying waste to the big record corpse who's gonna sign you then. But give up your ideals, and no amount of eddies can buy him back. All right, Princess. At least you played some gigs. Saw those memories of yours. True. Played where we could. Parks, old factories, underground clubs. Had an audience from the start. Some recorded our stuff didn't even know who we were. 
So, you're saying some old samurai bootlegs are still floating around town? I smell heads. No idea you were such a materialist. Could almost cry. Almost. Jokes aside, I think those tapes still exist after all these years. Hmm, you know, Rainbow Cadenza is not far from here. Club we played till the band fell apart. Great spot. Place for people with their heads on straight. Maybe they'll know something. Um, Johnny? Pretty sure they turned your great spot into a slurp shop. Mindless fucking consumerism wins the day again. Point for the other team, huh? Huh. This is... Why you don't bring back fallen warriors. Sooner or later, they're gonna see everything they fought for is turned to shit. I'm talking to you. Okay, you getting what you want? Hey. Rainbow Cadenza mean anything to you? Oh no, another one. Aren't you too young for this? To what now? Every day, some sad grandpa in his old leather comes in here, asks where is his old rainbow club. And I'm like a broken record. Tell all of them the corp brought them out 20 years ago. I should put up a sign. Know anything about bootlegs from the Rainbow Cadenza days? Like, say, don't know, samurai stuff? Saki's on the house! Samurai. Samurai. Tiger claw ball hole. Oh, that ugly red face on black? Yeah, even I know that one. Old guy comes by here sometimes wearing their shirt. Spends the whole time yakking with his psycho fan friends. Wouldn't happen to know where I could find him? You can find him living back in the 2020s. <laughs> but besides that, he's out there at the market. Meaning he does his shopping there? I mean, you can do yours at his spot, assuming you'd even want to. He sells ancient dusty tapes of ancient dusty indie bands. No one's heard of a single one of them. Prem, thanks. Been in Night City long now? Long enough to know I should not answer seemingly harmless questions. Eat, pay, and be on your way. Could go for a bite. I figured. What can I get you? Hey, looking for some good tunes. Got any laser pop? Something for muskrats? Don't sell no scop here. You either want good music or rainbow bright shite. Chill, Jim. Just a joke. <laughs> laser pop? Fucking laser pop? Here? At my stand? Heard I can get some decent tunes here. What you mean by decent? We got Cartesian duelists. Urdine stuff, Tainted Overlord. Any samurai? <laughs> Kid, you even gotta ask? Never fade away. Dancing with my axe, chipping in, you name it, we got it. Silverhand was the one true messiah of rock. I'd hand them records out like candy if I could. But a guy's gotta eat. See, I found Silverhand's biggest fan. And proud of it. Today's bitty box rockers can't even touch him. Silverhand had something they couldn't even dream of. Uh, Silverhand? He had that fire, kid. Fire! Guy shook the foundations of the corporal world. He died for his ideals. Doesn't matter, he was also kind of a terrorist. Blaze way down the rebel path. Yeah, looking for the real deal. Like, say... Bootlegs from Samurai's first gigs? Fuck! First, you have got no idea what you're asking for. Not if you're so, so chilled about it. Don't know how you found out about them bootlegs, but forget it. 
Not gonna give him to the first gonk off the street. Hey, a poser. Know everything there is to know about Silverhand. Go on. Impress me. Know what he told Carrie the last time they met. Fuck this band. Not your crowd, not your noise. Do your own thing. Yeah, sure. I could think up a million conversations they had. There were no witnesses. Would the first gonk off the street know what they tell new Arasaka suits? They say, if a collar in training doesn't make deadline, the ghost of a man split in two will get him. Of course, nobody remembers the ghost is Johnny. All right, I'm impressed. Getting someone from Saka to tell you that. You're not joking. You're really a Silverhand fan. He's with me every step I take, every move I make. Johnny's like my conscience, my eternal, infernal moral compass. <laughs> well said, kid. Getting a little misty eyed. You're all right. Hey, anyways. Gotta educate the youth. Maybe you'll find something special under the table. Gone. Have at it. Much appreciated. Take it. Spread the good silver hand word. Death to Corpos. You know, they say time is the best teacher. Used to think that was true. But look at that guy. 60 at least, but still living in 2020. Guy's your biggest fan. Not happy to meet him? Blue Saka Tower to smithereens, and it's still standing there. Just the same. Don't want people getting stuck in a rut. Stuck in the past. Want them to change. Them and the world. In 60 years, something must have changed. Know what changed? The damn facade. Fresh interface plugs, new high fructose scop syrup, and fun fruity flavors. A new face of Arasaka, same old shit, different packaging. Something's changing. Maybe we can't see it, but there's change all the same. Sure. Now almost nobody remembers when a person wasn't just a meat bag full of secondhand implants.
How's Biz treating you, Cassius? Lately? Can't complain. MaxTac raided a black clinic not long past. Since then, custom accounts gone up, and so my prices. Coincidence? <laughs> you decide. Let's see what's good. Take your pick. Do not look so bad. Then, in the car, I doubted you would survive. Why'd you help me anyway? I needed you to leave. That hasn't changed. This about the biochip? That why I'm here? Hmm. I hear it's damaged beyond the repair. Any attempt to extract it would be disastrous. Fatal for you. Vic likes to talk, I guess. Not many could do what he did. You should be thankful. What's it you actually want from me? To begin, you must tell me where to find Evelyn Parker. Evelyn? What's she to you? She and Yorino Varasaka had intimate relations. She knows how to get to him. Been thinking I ought to have a word with her myself. She promised to help me get rid of the chip. I would not count on that. She's likely gone very far away. Why you figure she skipped town? I tried to locate her, but had no success. I suspect she covered her tracks. You said Parker could help you remove the relic. Does she work for a corporation? Got no clue. Evelyn was knowledgeable about the relic, had a large chunk of classified info. An enigma, to be sure, but she showed that slyness you get in corpo agents. You know the kind. I too possess this slyness you speak of. You got tossed out, lumped with the outcasts, easily. Or have you forgotten? <sighs> Sorry, I couldn't be of any help. Don't have any time to lose. Be, so. wait. I need you. Yorinobu Arasaka must answer for this crime of patricide. <laughs> Looking for justice? In Night City? I seek revenge. Much more feasible here. I have allies prepared to bring Yorinobu to his knees. The only thing I need is proof. And you think they'll trust the word of a merc? I have nothing better now. Also, I know no one here, and I am a fugitive. I am hunted. What if I say no? Then I will tell you what rewards await if you help me. So what, we stroll into Arasaka HQ and announce that Yorinobu's a kin killer? That he murdered Saburo? We'll get the hearing before reasonable people. 
in a neutral location. Certain procedures will be used to establish the truth. A lie detector? Forget it. In that case, another option. You are dying. You do not know how to save yourself. A chip, the relic, is a culprit. Technology made by Arasaka. Technology they alone know. This corporation can save you as easily as it can make you disappear. It is merely about getting the right people on your side. Politics. Exactly what kind of people are we talking about? People who hold Arasaka dear are its heart. People interested in the corporation's stable growth. You mean people like Anders Hellman? You know this name? How? Prepped for the heist thoroughly. Relic is Hellman's design, his creation. And true, he's a pawn. I was thinking of one much more powerful. Besides, Anders Hellman escaped to Arasaka. Betrayed it. Now, Hanako-sama, I would first like to ask you... Fucking Saka scums everywhere. Hey! I was listening to that! Shut up! Nobody except you wants to watch that shit about that corpo cunt. What did you say? You heard me. Let it go, Takamura. Hmm. At least one of you's got some fucking sense. Last thing we want to do is draw attention. I'm sorry. A stupid reflex. Thanks for the offer. Need to think about it. Get back to you. I need time to plan, organize. You stand to gain much if you help me. All I ask is that you do not leave the city. Leave? Why would I leave? Need help. Best chance I'll find the right person here. Someone other than Arasaka specialist? There's no one. No alternative. Actually, we just talked about some. With a bit of luck, I'll track down Evelyn. If she could not help you before, she will not manage to now. Honor among thieves. Ever heard of it? Yes, I thought it ironic. Thieves have none. There's just honor, I believe. You're an Obu Arasaka degree? I'm sure. The Parker woman will not help you. Why are you? I would think about the plan B. Anders Hellman. He invented the relic. If I want to get rid of it, He's my man. And if that means picking another fight with Arasaka, so be it. Hellman defected from the company. I myself spent many days looking for him. He... What's the expression? Dropped off the face of the earth. Defected? Where to? Some other corp poach him? As far as I can tell, he acted alone. A meticulous man. He planned it. Covered his tracks very well. Any idea where he took off to? None. Hmm, somebody's been busy the last few days. I will not sit and do nothing when there is information to be found. Things to prepare. Your job, basically. It was my job. Why are you looking for Hellman? He was the one to alert Saburo-san to Yorinobu's schemes. He knew both of them well and could be an important witness. Corporal rats squeal when hanging by their tails. For several days, I collected the information. All leads point to one place, the club called The Afterlife. I was quickly dismissed by the queen of fixers there, Rogue. Mean to say you worked for Saburo, yet got no idea how to talk to the High and Mighty. 
She wished to have nothing to do with the man accused of murdering Saburo Arasaka. Rogue's well informed. Gets wind of most things that happen in the city. Might be worth asking her about Hellman. I wish you luck. Dolma is choosy, expensive, and rude. I cannot stay here any longer. Do what you want. Look for Parker, Hellman, whoever. I must see some friends, call in some favors. When my people in Arasaka are ready to listen, I will call you. Till then, I guess. If by some miracle you find Hellman, please notify me. He and I have unfinished business. Zapper dumples and filth. In some ways, Night City never changes. Arasaka's still a despotic machine, and the world's on a collision course with chaos. But hey, at least Rogue's still alive. You know, you've got some nerve. First you're out to kill me, now you want to be my pal and make like nothing happened? You know you don't gotta speak out loud to talk to me. What do you want? And I've processed some shit, changed my mind. Don't want you dead anymore. Go fuck yourself, dick wipe. Hey, wasn't easy for me either. You woke up in a landfill, I woke up in your head. Wrestling with your thoughts, memories. Think we're even. And I've taken a step back, looked at things. Think we might be able to help each other. We could start with Rogue. Her and I go back to the Stone Age. Why should I trust you? Remind me again? Trust me, don't trust me. I don't give a fuck. It's the least of our worries, anyway. You are the ghost of Christmas past, asshole. Any friends you've had are either dead or so old their memory's gone. Johnny Silverhand died a legend. Nobody forgets that. So you fucking know Rogue. What would I say to her? I got a talking brain tumor claims it's her old friend Johnny? Trust me, Rogue's heard dumber shit than that. Way back, when you weren't even an itch in your daddy's ball sack. Don't need convincing. Seen your memories. Gross. Rogel danced any tune I play or just get us to the afterlife. There is no us. Hey, look. What happened to going out and drinking to forget? No. Huh? Interesting. Would you look at that? You see it too, right? Yeah. Either gone completely whacked or I'm having a mystical moment. What's that chick's name? The one with the hair? Misty? Nah. More likely a neuron misfire for Victor to check out. Or maybe ask them both. Okay. I know you're talking about. They fixed that one pretty quick. Look before you leave. Yeah, жесть, конечно. Хорошо, что мы знали, что делать.
Repeat code zero in this area. All units resume normal duties. Which means I'm happy, which means you get your eddies and everyone's happy. Contract closed. Thanks, V.